<clears throat> Hello, my uh, name is Jerry with uh, Yes Magic, and uh, we've done several video. I've done several videos, but uh, go ahead and, and do this one. This is a uh, going to do a camel. I've got a dollar bill, and I have already folded the edges toward the front of the bill. We turn it over like this, and we. Uh, Fold it in the middle, or fold it to find out where the middle is, and I've got it uh, facing me, and we fold this, you know, kind of like an airplane when we was a kid, and uh, we fold it twice, go all the way to the middle both times and we wind up with something like that okay. now we take the edges outer edges and put both of them almost to the middle we're going to leave just enough room to, to fold them together. I didn't get these here exactly right, but uh, it uh, you'll see that it really doesn't make that much difference on these preliminary folds. Now we fold one side over the other and we wind up with something like this okay <coughs> you see that uh, giraffes and camels are both going to be uh, a majority of the folds are, it's just a bunch of reverse folds what I'm going to do I'm going to right here on this, almost on that edge of the pier, almost to the pyramid, I'm going to make a a reverse fold right here that goes down. You'll see. Take it like this, kind of spread it out. Gonna make a 90 degree fold. Well, here's my side. Kind of a 90 degree fold. You can see it's just like that. I'm going to open up that fold. In each edge, we're going to fold almost, again, almost to the middle. What we're doing here, we're essentially, all we're doing is just making the, uh, the leg skinnier, like that. Okay. Now, I'm going to go to the... Uh, other side of the pyramid, almost to the other side of the pyramid, and I'm going to make another reverse fold, except this reverse fold will go down like that, kind of in that direction. Let me go ahead and turn it around and make the fold and show you the results when we fold it. We make a reverse fold. We just fold it all the way down. Now, we're going to make another reverse fold. Another reverse fold over here, the, the length of, uh, of this leg over here, we're going to reverse fold it so the bottom comes out there. We will we'll fold it up like this and we will fold it all the way like that. Where the, and sometimes you got to Take it out a little bit, in a little bit, until you get the uh, the legs pretty close to the same height, like that. Again, we're going to do the same thing with this fold as we did with these. We're going to open it up, and we're going to fold each edge toward the middle, almost to the middle, not quite, of course, because 
again we have to leave room to to close the fold back like that and we wind up with a a long skinny neck okay now at this point we decide well are we going to make a camel or a giraffe well since we've already made a giraffe we'll make a camel and it's another reverse fold except it's a reverse fold down here you just fold it over just go down as about as far as you can probably about halfway and you make another reverse fold here okay like that and then back up here almost to the top of the leg you make another reverse fold going up like that you can see we had a reverse fold going down all the way down and then we have a reverse fold coming all the way back up. And after we get up here, we make another reverse fold right here uh, for the head. We make it down like this. And again, we want to, to reverse fold this white part because if you don't, what will happen is it will look like a camel has a bird beak on it. We want us to square it off a little bit and you can call that a camel or you can call it an alpaca if you want to if you if you if you want to do that we see the resemblance between the the camel and the uh, and making the uh, giraffe very similar thing when we make the elephant if you've mastered the uh, giraffe you have almost mastered the camel and vice versa if you have mastered the elephant you have almost mastered the rhinoceros up all the way up to here they're the same uh, my name's Jerry with yes magic and that's about it and I uh, uh, thank you for watching and I uh, welcome your comments and again uh, I know the production sucks but the information that I believe is is pretty good. Uh, well, I welcome uh, any comments that uh, that you may have. Thank you very much.